Custard tart and a cream slice. Well, I'm glad you're having that, because I've been staring at it for the last couple of hours. <laughs> Peckish. No, not really. What's up? Oh, I've been trying to tell myself I'm imagining it's none of my business. What in? I saw Phelan and Eileen in the bistro. Together. Together, together? Well, if not, they look like they're well on the way. So that's why she split with Michael. What? She almost talked about now else all day. Oh, we can't let this happen. We've got to warn her. Well, she's not going to listen to me, is she? Nobody else has. But that's because you never told him the full story. Well, no, because I couldn't. She doesn't know what she's getting herself into. No, I'm sorry, is it? I can't stand there and relive my worst nightmare. I'm, I'm sorry, I just can't. I know it's going to be hard, but you can't not. If you make it easier, I could get Eileen's number from Sean and then you could ring her, rather than having to do it face to face. You've got to do it, Anna. You will never forgive yourself if something happened. I do have feelings for you. I'm really sorry. I shouldn't have said anything. I'm so stupid. Do me a favour. Just.